Hey everybody, Test Launch recently just sent me some new accessories for me to review. Let's go check them out. Test Launch sent me over these two cooler bags. Uh, they're actually designed for the Model Y Frunk. It's going to be pretty cool because uh, I do a lot of Costco runs during the summer. And uh, this will probably help uh, utilize free up some space in my trunk. And also, we're gonna, I'm also going to test out these bags to see how long these stays cool. Also, they sent me over these real matte carbon fiber mirror caps. They also sent me over these two side marker uh, camera caps. And also a phone mount. And the last accessory is the under the front seat storage box. All right, so one of the things you want to do before putting on the mirror caps on the car is you want to make sure you want to get it cleaned off. So right now, I'm going to make sure I'm watered alcohol. What I'm going to do is I'm going to spray. Get everything all cleaned off. Get a clean microfiber towel. And clean it all off. Next thing you want to do now is you want to make sure you take off all the uh, the labels and then we're going to soak it again and we're going to put it on. So after you get all the labels off the sticker, what we're going to do is you're going to take the same bottle, you're going to drench the mirror. So the reason why we do that is so we can slide the mirror on nice and smooth and the alcohol in the water is going to evaporate real quick. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to take some painter's tape and then we're going to paint, hold the, uh, the mirror cap down so it'll let it dry off. All the side marker covers we're gonna do the same thing we want to clean this all off so the uh, double-sided tape can adhere to the surface really really well all right we'll just first spray this up all right After you take off the, uh, the, the tape cover, all we're gonna have to do is just place this on. Just like that. So these bags comes in two pieces, right? So you got one side of the frunk and the other side of the frunk. And the great thing about it is it comes in a handle. And on top of that, it actually has a sling bag to put around your, put around your arm, so or around your shoulder. So you got two of those, okay? And then inside here, it's insulated. So it's actually, it's actually pretty thick. You can definitely feel there's more insulation inside here, so which the quality is pretty good. All right, let's go try it out. As you can see how, as you can see here, it fits pretty well. It's actually a little space on each side. Uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna get some ice packs and throw them in there. 
and uh, wait a few hours and see what happens, see if it's still cold, is it, is it really worth it? Is it gonna make the Costco run a lot easier? We'll take a look. I also found that if you open the bag and you actually push down, it'll fit into the front a lot better. So I got two ice packs here. I'm gonna throw in one in each and see how it goes. We'll come back in a few hours. All right, so yesterday I was gonna take this out after a few hours, but I forgot it and left it and left the ice packs in the cooler overnight. And just to touch it, it's actually still cold. I brought one of my guns here. Let's take a look. It is saying the ice pack is still at 36 degrees. So these coolers right over here, it's definitely worth getting a set if you want to go on some road trips or possibly making a large Costco run. Pretty good spot to have a car mount right behind the steering wheel with the MagSafe. Now I can use Waze or you can use other maps rather than using the Tesla navigation system. So the draw for underneath the seat actually works out really well. I can put in my test launch uh, sunshade in here. If it's perfect, I can put a bunch of other tools in here and make things a little easier. Perfect. Extra storage. All right, so I want to give you my final review on the test launch accessories that they sent over to me. Uh, these accessories were given to me to give my honest review. So I just want to go over some accessories I've gotten so far. So number one, uh, I'm really liking the Frunk bags. Uh, these uh, cooler bags are pretty cool. As you can see here, they're, they're definitely well insulated and you can definitely use these bags uh, when I'm making my Costco runs or I'm going to a local supermarket and getting some frozen foods, especially during the summer. Uh, you know, it gets really hot out here. Uh, the other accessories I really like a lot are the real matte carbon fiber mirror caps and the camera caps, uh, side marker caps. They are, they look really, really sharp. Uh, I like the looks of them. Uh, makes my car look different compared to the other Model Ys that's out in the road. And it also makes it easy for me to find out which is my car in the parking lot being that now there are a bunch of white Model Ys that's out there. So that's a huge plus there. Uh, thank you, Test Launch, for those accessories. And the car mount. I'll probably use the car mount. I have one there already, uh, but I'll probably use the Test Launch because it actually has a swivel mount on top. And the under-the-seat uh, cargo tray, the cargo box, I think it's pretty cool. I think it's uh, a nice accessory to have, especially when you're limited with space. And uh, to be honest with you, I actually have a, a bunch of things in there. I got a few tools in there. I have the test launch um, sunshade for the windshield that's there as well. Nice and compact. So definitely fit a few more uh, of things in there as well. But I'm definitely super happy with the quality of the product and the accessories I sent over. Uh, highly recommend checking them, them out. Uh, I have the link and the discount code in the description. So if you guys are interested in purchasing something and save some few dollars, you can definitely do so. Um, as always, thank you for all the viewers out there. Thank you for all who have subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, please definitely do. And also, if there's anything you want me to review or anything you want me to cover, please leave a comment below and I'll definitely catch up to it. But thank you all and I'll catch you all on the road.